New this morning, the first bird flu outbreak in California, and it's in Sacramento County. The CDC says the outbreak took place about a week ago today. ABC 10's Devin Truby joins us outside the California Farm Bureau with what's being done to keep local poultry industry safe and those jobs secure. Devin. Well, while the outbreak happened in about a flock of 10 birds in a backyard producer, so the CDC qualifies that as non poultry, but the California Poultry Federation and those that use birds for their livelihood say concern is at an all time high. Biosecurity for poultry farms is set at the highest level due to concerns over bird flu. Ken Mitchell on Mitchell Farms is going as far to not let mail and deliveries come onto his property, hauling his own trash to make sure interaction is limited. Anybody entering the facility, the, the UPS driver, I mean, everything doesn't go past the gate, everything's dropped off, so, you know, we can control what we can control. The, the current outbreak has killed more than 40 million turkeys and chickens across the country. Bird flu viruses do not normally infect humans, but it can happen. Ken can't control wild birds flying overhead or his other concern. <laughs> Bird flu appearing in backyard chicken flocks and owners not knowing it's there and it spreads rapidly. Oh, it's devastating because if you're under federal quarantine, nothing leaves the facility. Um, they, you have to clean the facility, test for it, and you're under uh, federal quarantine, so that could be four to, to seven or eight months, which could be, you know, me out of business. Bill Matos, the president of California Poultry Federation, echoes the concern of farmers to have threats of bird flu on top of an existing productivity concern. It's not bird flu driving up the price of poultry, but a staffing shortage with productivity sitting around 85 percent. We can't uh, supply all Californians, California grown. We can only supply half the half the state right now. Right now, there are no outbreaks in any commercial flocks in California, and it's important to note that this does not impact any food that you're currently buying in the grocery store, Walt. Okay, so for right now, that's that's the good news. But but down the road in the immediate future, what concerns should people have? Yeah, so the big concern coming up for us in a little less than a month is the migration of birds over California back up north. And that's where we're seeing a lot of bird flu right now in those wild birds for us. And the impact really for California is because we're the state that consumes the most chicken, turkey and eggs. The average Californian, it's about 20 chickens a year. So that's why there's the concern for us and amongst our California farmers. Walt. Yeah, that that is something to to be concerned about. OK, that's Devin Truby. Devin, thank you very much.